Hello, welcome to the channel. My name is Kevin and this is the Dimmy channel. Before we get into the video today, I just want to say that at the end there's a bit of a bonus section of uh, Z Laner of two minutes of very exciting gameplay. He gets five kills within two minutes, so it's well worth sticking around for that. I was fucking, I, I, my aim was, my aim, my aim freaking uh, aim assist was just going right through the, right through the wall on that guy. Oh, be quiet, Z. The big boys are talking. You'll get your chance later. Today's video is about expanding on my previous ones of Zelena's layer cake. The five key visual clues of how he's cheating. In the previous one, we concentrated on uh, layer one, which was the uh, lower box or foot to knee lock. And today we're gonna be pixel perfect on the side outer box and the inner box and when i say pixel perfect i do mean pixel perfect so let's get into it I was fucking. I, I, my aim lock was. That. My aim. My aim. Freaking. Uh, aim assist was just going right through the, right through the wall on that guy. Okay, so here's the techie bit. I freeze framed it here because this is the first time that this person is actually in sight, although he's already ADS'd, uh, and he's been tracking him along this wall, and that will come evident in a moment. But this is the first time he's actually appeared. So we have to do some measurements to see if we can prove he has been tracking him through this wall and that he tracks him across here. What we've done, we've calculated what his height is, and uh, I've got it written down here somewhere. Um, yeah, his height is 60. And then if we know what his height is, we can, and where the center of, of his, uh, his player model is, or his spine if you like, we can then calculate this distance here because that's what's important. So yeah, we've got the height at 60 pixels. And we're just gonna play this through a little bit. So I've already put the this stuff up on it. And the distance from the center of his frame to um, the, the vertical center of the screen is 240 pixels. So here's 60 height and 240 pixels off, off um, the center. <clears throat> Given that, I can do a calculation. And I can forecast where the outer, oh, sorry, inner box of this player is. And it will be uh, 240 divided by 60. And that comes out at um, 4. We've then got to multiply that by 20 and then multiply that again by 0 0.625. The 0 0.625 is actually a um, an adjustment figure for the canvas. So that all comes out. So we've got uh, 240 divided by 60, which is 4, times 20, which is 80, times 0 0.625, which is 50 pixels. And the fact that it's actually come out as a nice round number gives me confidence. So what that works out at is I'm going to be putting an out of box line uh, 50 pixels away from the center of the spine. And we're just going to see how that um, how he, he interacts with that. 
So if this distance doesn't change, he's doing perfect tracking. So got, he's not seen this guy yet, but he's already ADS'd. So here's the 240 distance. Fully ADS now, and here comes our chap. So this is 240. All the calculations for where this bar goes is based off 240 off of there. If it's tracking dead center of his spine, we know that he has got perfect tracking. And this is the inner box, which is 50 from the center of there. Still there. Now, he now gets to close in. But watch what happens. Perfect to the inner box. And he stays there until he drops his ADS. Okay. So we'll go back at slightly to the beginning. A little past it so we can see that in action. So he's ADS'd. Perfect tracking. I was fucking, uh, my aim lock was, my aim, my aim freaking, uh, aim assist was just going right through the, shut up, right through the wall and that Shut guy. up, see, we know, we know. Okay, so we just go through that again. So, player's 60 high, it's 240 from the center of the screen, and he did perfect tracking, that distance did not change throughout. Until this guy stops and he closes in. He triggers it to close in, realises, oops, I'm getting out of there. Why did he take a shot? Because it would look too suspicious. So now I'm going to take uh, the opportunity to answer some of the questions and queries that um, have been raised uh, both on the, the channel and uh, also on, on Twitter. Um, so let's go for some of these. Uh, let's have a look. Uh, AOI says, can you find clips that display more of the same aim mechanics because that video made my eggplant twitch? Well, <laughs> fair play AOI. Um, yes, this video actually uh, introduces it. At the end of this video, there's a two minute clip that has um, every aspect of, of layer cake in it. Um, and so yeah, we'll uh, be breaking that down in future videos. That's why I've included it in this so people can view it before I actually put out my content on it. Um, what else have we got? Uh, let's have a look. I'm just trying to see what else is going on down here. Uh, we've got a question. Um, could I do the same with uh, floor loot with big horizontal this side? This one is from Jussi Carcanion. I'm sorry if I said that wrong. Um, floor loot with big horizontal recoil would be worth checking too. Um, I, I wasn't prepared to go looking through hundreds and hundreds of videos just for say an LMG or something like that. But most SMGs um, that are floor loot They've got some recall, even the ones that you know you, you build yourselves. A lot of the SMGs have got recall, despite what all the um, the, the, the streamers say. Oh, absolutely zero recall. They, they have recoil. It, it's visible on screen um, and, and can be demonstrated by the same way that I demonstrated that on the last video. He had no recoil. I can do exactly the same thing to prove a gun has recoil. Uh, which I will be doing a comparison between a, very, uh, a, a mystery top streamer using the same weapon as Z Laner. Z Laner has absolutely zero recoil, and the mystery streamer, yeah, he, he, it's quite evident there's a lot of recoil there. So I'll be doing a, a comparison, same weapon, same sk alleged skill levels. They've got the similar, but very similar KDs, um, and we'll see it just how they compare. Um, but yeah, so um, the video at the end of this, you'll see the salt no. and, and what we've used here. It's a floor loot SMG, 
um, and he uses it to great effect with zero recoil um, in, in the vast majority of cases where he's got clear line of sight um, actually a lot of people are asking the same sort of things can I it, it's a very good video that I put out the last time um, excellent proof but it needs to be repeated well you'll see later when you watch the clip um, without any of my um, my little work on it um, pure taken from his stream that there you know it, it's all evident the um, their cake is evident throughout that that clip coming up uh, do, 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 um, <laughs> Yeah, um, there was a question there about comparing to another streamer, um, and that's, I just said that one. Okay, so that answers a few of the questions. So, yeah, watch the clip at the end. Um, I'll play it through the full two minutes. Uh, I think it's um, six kills, five kills, six kills in quick succession, and um, at normal speed. And then I'll, I'll, I'll play it back again after that at maybe... 50% just for posterity you can have a look see if you can see things in there and then see if you can catch me out on my next videos see if you pick up something that I, I don't so thanks for watching and uh, catch you on the next one